James Surowiecki, The Wisdom of Crowds. Discover the true power of diverse and independent thinking in the book, The Wisdom of Crowds by James Surowiecki. Delve into how heterogeneous groups prove more efficient and resourceful than homogeneous ones, especially when tackling complex problems. Learn about the significance of diversity, independent thinking, and effective group structures in decision-making. Explore how herd behavior, social proof, and hierarchies can hamper a group's intelligence, and gain insights on how effective coordination within big groups can lead to better outcomes. This summary will help you understand the vital concepts and provide practical examples from the book. The Wisdom of Diversity A group made up of people with diverse backgrounds, ages, genders, religions, and professions would perform better at problem-solving than a homogenous group, according to the author. The homogenous group's opinion can often lead to disastrous results because their shared skill sets and approaches limit their abilities to consider unconventional ideas and counterarguments. Experts are necessary in groups, but their exclusive presence poses a danger, especially if they belong to the same field. The author concludes that a heterogeneous team can quickly eliminate bad ideas with wider perspectives and manifold viewpoints, leading to smarter decisions. The power of big groups. The larger the group, the more diverse its members, and the more valuable ideas and skills it brings together. Big groups are better at considering unusual perspectives and minority opinions, leading to better decision making. In contrast, small groups are more volatile and susceptible to influence and radical decisions. Moreover, people in small groups tend to overestimate their abilities and can be biased towards their own solutions. In experiments, higher-ranking pilots defended their wrong solutions, and lower-ranking navigators conceded their right opinions. The bigger the group, the less likely it is that irrational opinions will prevail, leading to smarter and more effective outcomes. Therefore, big groups can openly confront conflicts and debate issues, creating a lower risk of quick yet faulty compromises, unlike small groups. In summary, big groups' power lies in their diversity, openness to different opinions, and increased intelligence. The Perils of Herd Behavior Groups tend to adopt herd behavior, a social defense mechanism aimed at reducing individual risk, whereby members conform to support group actions or decisions. This may lead to fallacies such as social proof, where people assume that certain actions are correct based on observing others. In groups with clear hierarchies, only the highest-ranking members may voice opinions, ruling out a diverse range of views. To avoid the perils of herd behavior, members must be encouraged to express individual opinions rather than blindly following these groups. Failure to address herd behavior weakens group intelligence, and so groups must embrace diversity and avoid hierarchies to promote positive outcomes. Independent thinking in groups the success or failure of group decision-making lies in the collective ability of its members to think independently. In groups where independent thinking is lacking, individuals tend to adopt similar views without question, leading to a lack of diversity of opinions and perspectives. This can result in poor decisions and grave consequences, as seen in the Columbia Space Shuttle disaster in 2003. Dominant leaders that impose their opinions on others can stifle healthy debate and prevent diverse viewpoints from emerging. The key to successful group decision-making is diversity, allowing individuals to contribute their own personal judgments and work together towards a consensus. Group intelligence can only be achieved when its members think independently. Decentralized groups Successful groups have a decentralized structure, allowing members to work independently towards a common goal. In ancient Athens, citizens could negotiate petty crimes in local courts and organize public events. However, this structure must also have a central place for information and operations to be analyzed to avoid missing the bigger picture. The United States intelligence branches suffered from a lack of centralization, which hindered the flow of information and prevented the prediction of the September 11, 2001 attacks. The most intelligent groups are decentralized but pool information into one central place. Coordination in groups 
In complex challenges, the success of a group depends on the ability of its members to coordinate themselves. Members must agree on their intentions, expectations, and actions, and put themselves in the shoes of others. The concept of mutual anticipation can be observed in everyday scenarios, such as pedestrians on city sidewalks. Thomas Schelling's experiment showed how people can coordinate their intentions and expectations to reach a collectively beneficial result. Coordination is essential for the success of the group, and individuals should avoid thinking only about themselves to prevent traffic and accidents. The Power of Cooperation Human beings have an innate desire to work in groups, but successful group functioning relies on individuals putting aside their short-term interests for long-term benefits. Rules and laws are established to enforce this behavior, but the ultimate goal is for individuals to cooperate voluntarily for the good of the group. Trust is crucial for prosocial behavior, but individuals also profit from cooperative behavior. The less stress individuals experience when making decisions, the more likely they are to act in ways that benefit the group as a whole. Ultimately, voluntary cooperation thrives when members believe in the longevity and overall payoff of the group. In conclusion, the wisdom of crowds highlights the importance of diverse and independent thinking within groups, leading to increased efficiency and better decision-making. Size, diversity, independent thinking, and coordination all play crucial roles in ensuring optimal group performance. By avoiding rigid hierarchies, fostering healthy debate, and encouraging decentralized structures that still centralize essential information, groups can leverage the collective wisdom for more intelligent decision-making. The book serves as a reminder to value the varied perspectives that come with diversity, recognizing that ultimately, it is a collective effort that results in the most successful outcomes.